the Washita Mountain Living Podcast. And it is not morning, and I'm not drinking coffee. I'm drinking some iced tea. All right. You know, not every video that I'm going to put up on here is going to be popular with everybody. Uh, yesterday sure wasn't. But... You know, as long as we've had a country, there's always two sides. People, you know, you may see thing one uh, see things one way. Somebody else is going to see it a whole different. And I understand that. But I'm not on here to talk about yesterday's video. What I am here to talk about is YouTube comments. And a, a friend of mine who I've known all my life messaged me a little bit ago. Said, "Why did you delete my comments?" I so said, "I didn't delete anybody's comments." I wouldn't have deleted his, I know him. And so, little bit, I'm in there looking in the review, because sometimes comments will go to a review folder. And then the channel owner will have to go through those comments, and, you know, if, if they're ugly comments or bad comments, then you have the opportunity to approve them or delete them. I do, get, I do delete comments, yes, I do. You know, I don't necessarily... Delete comments because you don't that you, because you uh, don't agree with me. Everybody's entitled to their opinion, but it's the way the tone that it may have been in, or it's just a stupid comment. You know, we get a lot of those. And but what happened is he he had made posted a comment on yesterday's video, and within he said twenty seconds it was gone. So he posted a comment while I was talking to him and I was on my channel and I seen it appear and it took a few tries. I seen the comment appear. I hearted it. And just a few seconds later, it was gone again. And I think it probably lasted a minute. I did not delete it. YouTube did. So a lot of times we don't even get to see them. YouTube deletes them before we even see them. Uh, there is a filter that will send, you know, there's keywords, and man, there's a lot of comments that there's nothing wrong with. There's no curse words, there's nothing, but they end up going to the folder where I have to review it. And I'm looking at it going, why is it, you know, because you got to understand, guys, it's not people behind a desk reading all of our comments, it's AI. And they pick out keywords, I, who knows what else they determine, and... We don't have any control over that. If if I never seen your comment, I couldn't have deleted it because YouTube did not let it go. And his comment is gone. It's like everything he posts on there is gone. But yet the idiot comments will come through, no problem. So I just wanted to clarify that that, you know, hey, and and I if I see a stupid comment or something's hateful, I'll delete. I'll delete it, and not only do I delete it, I usually block that person. And I don't even really know how that works. I think uh, if you are blocked from somebody's channel, uh, nothing you to you, I think you, you wouldn't even know it because you can still watch that person's videos. You can still comment. The only thing is, your comment is not being seen by anybody. But if you were to look at the video, me and Jeff were going to do an experiment one time, and I was going to block him from my channel, and then he was going to leave comments to see. We still need to do that, just to see if he thinks he's getting his comment on there. Because otherwise, I mean, I I don't think they block you from watching somebody's video. I don't know, but unbelievably i have not blocked that many people i don't have anybody blocked on there yeah, there's one person blocked on this channel uh it, it's just a person that goes to everybody's channel starts trouble and so they are in the blocked list but other than that there's nobody else on this channel so but that is what it you know and i didn't realize that was happening until he messaged me and i'm like i'm trying to defend myself hey i didn't delete your comment and so then I went and looked just to see if I might have accidentally blocked him or something. I went into the settings where it has a list of all the people you block. He's not in there. So YouTube, for whatever reason, and like I said, it's AI. If, sorry, guys, if I'm, you see me looking over at the camera, uh, 
I'm expecting something from the post office. Yeah, their, their FedEx came, but the post office, you go to look at tracking, it says nothing. And they're handling most of Amazon now, so. But anyway, yes, that is why, um, you know, almost every single video, you're going to get stupid comments. You're going to get comments where people don't, you don't have to agree with any, with, with you know, there's why I watch a lot of videos. I don't agree with somebody. Uh, I don't, I'm not much of a commenter. Uh, most of the time when I'm watching videos, I'm in there on my TV and you can't comment from there. I, I think you can, but it's a pain. So that has been proven that that is happening. Um, and his comments still taken down. It is not in my review folder. So we only have so much control. It's their platform. We're just channels. And, you know, if, if we don't know the comments there, well, we there's nothing we can do about it. But it makes me wonder how many comments that I would probably like to see are not getting through. You know? How, how many things are being said that you probably would like to know? Maybe there's a lot of them there ain't. You know, and overall, they do a pretty good job of... Uh, I wouldn't want to use the term censor, but yeah, well, censor out some of the hateful... I mean, we get death threats, trust me. It's happened to me. And that went through... So how do you how do you justify letting that go through? And then somebody got on there and said, "Hello, I like your channel." And that is in the review in the review uh, folder. I've had messages that's that innocent that they wanted me to re to review, and there's nothing wrong with them. So there there's certain words they pick up on. I guess if you use that word, uh, I, I do know cussing will get you sent to the review. And I allow, you know, I, I'm not encouraging people to get on my comment section and, and, you know, cuss like a sailor. Because that will get you put in the review, uh, into the review folder. And then I have to go in there and manually approve it. Uh, but, but it does catch some that are really cussing you out for something. And so it's a good feature to have. But I don't like the part where they're deciding if that's a good comment or they're deciding no he don't need to read this or that see that's to me is true censorship and i don't like it but as i said this is their platform and i'm just a channel and so i don't have that control i don't and it's probably ai you know the people in charge don't even realize it's going on or do they i don't know there's just some things about any kind of social media platform, uh, we don't understand the, some of the things they do. Facebook is the worst. I don't know how many times. I might as well have a lifetime cell in the Facebook jail as often as I go into that jail. You know, hate speech, things like that. And there's nothing to do with hate speech. But they pick up on certain things and they think, oh, you're, yeah, you're a bad person. So anyway, guys, I'm just kind of taking the day off today. Haven't been working, and uh, I don't care. It's good to rest once in a while. Thank you guys for watching. Happy trails.